Hello, governor. It's raining today here in England. This is my fake English accent. You gotta put a bit more emphasis on everything like you normally do. You know what I'm saying, like? That's not English at all. Good day. I'm from England, don't you know? The Queen's English. Oh, for fuck's sake. Stop pulling out every... I got traffic coming from both sides. I'm going now. Woo so, last night I watched The Incredible Hulk, uh, the second one, the one with Ed Norton in it. Now, I'm all set up to watch The Avengers this summer. It's gonna be, it's gonna be eventful, you know. If you don't know what The Avengers is, then more for you. Um, basically it's a comic book movie. Um, so far in comic book movies we've had Batman, Spider-Man, Superman, the X-Men, Iron Man, the Hulk, Captain America, the Punisher, the Phantom, <laughs> Phantom, uh, Wonder Woman, Catwoman, there's, there's been a hell of a lot of superhero movies over the years, but this is the first one that's going to culminate them all into one plate. Well, not all of them, but some of them. Um, so essentially you have the Avengers, which is Captain America, Iron Man, the Incredible Hulk. Spider-Man is not in it because his movie is licensed out to another person. Not just one person, it's just... One guy has the Spider-Man license, he's like, NO! YOU CAN'T HAVE IT! No, he's licensed out to Sony or some shit like that. Um, Sony Pictures. Uh, he's getting a reboot, so... I saw the trailer for that the other day, and I'm not really as grabbed as it as I was the original. He looks a bit too... Meh. And, uh... So yeah, The Avengers. Um, Iron Man... Fuck man, why's my head suddenly gone blank? I'm just talking about it, literally. Iron Man, Thor, Captain America, and the Incredible Hulk's in it, and you've got Hawkeye in it as well, who's also one of the Marvel heroes. Am I missing someone? I don't think I am. No, that should be it. But they've, each, they've made individual movies for Iron Man. They've made two Iron Man movies, a Thor movie, Captain America, and two Hulk movies now. And the good thing is, they've got the actors from, well, from Thor, Iron Man, and Captain America. They're sticking with those people in the Avengers movie, which is brilliant because, you know, the first Hulk movie had Eric Banner in it playing Bruce Banner. Um, and then the second Hulk movie had Ed Norton playing Bruce Banner. And now in the Avengers movie, there's someone else playing Bruce Banner, whose name I don't know, because I didn't research it. Um, but he's no one I recognise, so... Hey, this road's been resurfaced, except that bit. Why would you fucking resurf the entire road but leave a huge dent in it? <sighs> and of course we got Dark Knight Rises this year. Which should be good. If you can understand what any anyone's saying in that movie. What with Batman going on? Wait a minute! Is talking. Where are the other drugs going? I'm that man. It's good, don't get me wrong, it's good, but I want Michael Keaton's Batman. <laughs> I heard I heard some news that Michael Keaton wants to make a new Beetlejuice film. I'd be totally one hundred percent up for that, because Beetlejuice is a great movie. get Winona Ryder in it again. She's a pretty lady. I like Winona Ryder. I 
I had a crush on her when I was younger and I watched Edward Scissorhands. That's a great movie. These girls I knew started calling me Edward because because of Edward Scissorhands. Because I've got really pasty white skin and dark hair. And I look like I'd, uh, I'd probably cut myself. <laughs> I'm quiet as well. And I'm a robot. And yeah, and then someone else decided to call me Edward after Twilight came out. Why is it? Why is it I get called Edward? My name isn't Edward. such bullshit. If he was a vampire, you'd be like... The whole sparkly thing in the sun is what really kills it, you know? Other than that, Twilight's not that bad. Why everyone complains about it. I think people hear one person say it and they're like, Oh, I've got to be cool. I've got to hate on this thing. It's like that Justin Bieber person. Rebecca Black. People hate them too for no reason whatsoever. They both wrote catchy songs and people like catchy songs and then people don't like what people like. That is the most back-ass logic I've ever th heard of. Think of. Thunk. It's the worst thing I've ever thunked of. This video's really dragging on, isn't it? I'm talking about fucking Twilight and Justin Bieber. All right, I'm gonna go now. Um, before you all think I am a homosexual. <laughs> all right, bye.